In this series, we'll be looking at some of the most advanced fighter aircraft from each notable war, starting with World War I. The Fokker DR-1 The Fokker DR-1 is arguably the most famous aircraft of World War I, despite only 320 being created. The instantly recognisable triplane was developed by the Dutch aircraft designer Anthony Fokker in 1917, who had already built a reputation in Germany for his ability to design and build exceptional planes, and the DR-1 would be the next addition to the Dutchman's resume. The DR-1's infamy rose through the legendary German ace pilot Manfred von Richthofen, which you'll recognise as the Red Baron. Manfred earned his last 19 air combat victories in the DR-1 thanks to its exceptional manoeuvrability at high altitudes and fantastic climb rate. The DR-1 was 18 foot 11 inches long with a wingspan of 23 foot and 7 inches. It was armed with twin 7.92 mm Spandau machine guns and had a top speed of 115 miles per hour from its 110 horsepower engine. The speed of the DR-1 was the triplane's fatal flaw as its three wings created so much drag that the Allied aircraft could easily outplace the German machine. The SE-5A Often compared with the Sopwith Camel, the SE-5A boasted better overall performance, which allowed the Allied forces to regain air superiority through the Royal Flying Corps. The British biplane was designed in 1916 to be easily flyable for novice and inexperienced pilots in order to increase the volume of efficient Allied pilots. This led to over 5,200 of the SE-5 and the SE-5As being built. The British fighter was 20 foot 11 inches in length and featured a wingspan of 26 foot 7 inches. The SE-5A featured two machine guns, a 7.7mm Vickers machine gun facing the front of the plane and a 7.7mm wing-mounted Lewis gun, which enabled the pilot to fire at an enemy aircraft from below. With a 138mph top speed from its 200 brake horsepower engine, the SE-5A speed was a decisive factor, which makes it regarded as one of the most important aircraft during World War I. The SPAD 13 The SPAD-13 was one of the best dogfighters during World War I. The French biplane was adopted by many Allied forces, in particular the Americans, who adopted the fighter in July 1918. The American ace Eddie Rickenbacker of the American Expeditionary Force quoted the SPAD-13 as the best ship I flew, which would explain why over 8,400 of these planes were built. This fast and rugged aircraft was designed in 1917 and specialised at diving at high speeds. However, it had a fatal flaw through its unreliable engine, which suffered due to poor lubrication and vibration. Despite having 230 brake horsepower, the SPAD-13 was equipped with two forward-facing synchronised 7.7mm Vickers machine guns, whilst featuring a length of 20 foot 6 inches and a wingspan of 25 foot 1 inches. Thanks for watching the video. Next time we'll be looking at some of the best fighters of World War II. Make sure you subscribe and leave a like and please leave a comment with any other World War I planes you believe should have been featured.